Howdy guys, it's Tachi and welcome back to part 10 of Let's Play the Book of Unwritten Tales. This must be the last market stall. The Nothing more is going to be sold here as long as the merchant is still playing that strange game. Hmm. So yeah, I think we have to, uh... It's going to say it's locked. No one home. Yeah, it's locked. So let's go head on out and look at some more stuff. Why not? I have a feeling that we're going to have to shut the game down. Hold, Hold on. Access only for authorized persons. Shield hand, are you the guard of the upper gate? Dead right. And you don't have access to the upper town. Um, uh, as I already mentioned to you at the outer gate, I must speak to the archmage. It's urgent. And as I've already mentioned to you, the guard at the upper gate follows very strict procedures. <laughs> but why didn't you say you were the guard? Well, I wasn't on duty, and you shouldn't mix business with pleasure. Anyway, it's much funnier this way. <laughs> oh, man. Hmm, I wouldn't be so sure about that. There has to be a way to get to see the Archmage. What would I have to do? Only people with personal invitations from the Archmage himself are allowed in. Do you have an invitation? Mm. Of course. And where is it? It's uh oh, it's an invisible invitation. An invisible invitation. Really? Yes, from the um unseen university. Never heard of it. So, where's the invitation? My uh oh, oh my dog ate it. I have no time for this. So, where's the invitation? You don't need to see my invitation. <laughs> I certainly do. <laughs> you don't need to see my invitation. <laughs> you really believe that'll work? Couldn't hurt. It was worth a try, wasn't it? <laughs> Not really. Oh, so, man. So, where's the invitation? I don't have it. No, unfortunately not. Well, there you go. Without an invitation, there's no way you'll ever be admitted to see the Archmage. But you could be admitted, of course. <laughs> if you were a mage yourself. Hmm. Mages are allowed to speak with the Archmage. Naturally. He's the head of the Order, after all. You know any mages by any chance? Well, I'd, I'd like to be one myself. Hmm. <laughs> and I'd like to be a dewdrop on a wood elf's butt cheek. <laughs> really? Uh... Why? Well, uh, I... Look, only mages or people with invitations can get into the tower. So I'd be able to see the Archmage if I was accompanied by a mage? No, the mage would be allowed up, not you. But you could, say, give a message to the mage. But I must speak to the Archmage himself, and I have to give him something. Well then, you must be a mage yourself. <laughs> How do you know whether someone is a mage or not? Their magical aura? Or by the charisma and wisdom they radiate? By their mage diploma. Huh? Every trained mage has a mage diploma. They can show it to me here, and then I let them into the upper town. So that means if I show you a mage diploma, I can see the archmage? Well, show me an honestly acquired mage's diploma, made out in your name, and I'll take you to the archmage myself. If there's no other way, then I'll just get my mage degree, or my name's not Underhill. <laughs> Good luck. You'll find the mage teacher in the tavern. Just see what he thinks of the idea. <laughs> How can I become an accredited mage, then? You? Not at all. <laughs> and how do others do it? Well, there are mage schools. There's one just down the street, Master Marcus's Magical Mage School. But Master Marcus shut up shop weeks ago. Now he spends the whole day sitting in the tavern playing some kind of role-play game. I'm going to get my mage diploma. Just you wait and see. That's right. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> hmm. Oh, man. There's no way I can do a full course of mage training just to get into the Archmage's Tower. Maybe the mage teacher will lend me a diploma. And once I've given up the ring, well, maybe I could really take a stab at it. Hmm. I see a sandwich. A sandwich. A basket. It belongs to Mr. Shieldhand. It contains the rest of his giant sandwich. 
a large canning jar with a lid. <laughs> so it's empty. I still laugh at the one ring. A basket. It... One ring to roll them all. We gotta take to the uh, talk to the mage again. Excuse me. Hmm. Hmm. Master Marcus, I need. Uh... Shh, I'm playing. Yes, but I urgently need. Uh... Later. But without a mage diploma, I can't. Listen, I really haven't got time right now. My character's tax return is due. I've been playing towards it for days. Not a prayer. I'm not going to get a blessed thing from Master Marcus as long as that game is running. We got to go in the server room. Or the server room. No choice. He made us do it. What the? A hairy demon. He's he's operating a machine. Hmm. It says online, whatever that means. I don't trust all this technology. The way I see it, it's all magic without the magic. The chair looks just like the chair the demon is sitting on. I guess it's a replacement chair. The chair looks just... A small black container. It could be an inkwell. The demon might notice if I were to take his inkwell and exact a terrible revenge. Hmm. For save games. <laughs> Sorry. The safe is locked and there's no way I can crack it either. That service chair is a pretty rickety piece of woodwork. The waste bin is right under the slot in the machine. Strange. Hmm. The waste bin is empty. The waste bin is empty. There are a lot of index cards in the filing cabinet. Each card bears a small table and a picture. The cards are sorted alphabetically. Hmm. Let's see. Rare watering can. Volume 5 litres. Use for geraniums increases potted plant lifespan by two. Epic folder offers room for up to 16 forms. <laughs> Slip resistant suspenders prevent sock slippage. Hmm. These index cards seem to contain descriptions of all the items in the game. <laughs> now, let's see if we can annoy the demon. <laughs> I have a feeling that we're going to have to use the, uh... Whoa, that demon's fast. He must have amazing intellectual powers. Hmm. I tried to use the saw. But let's saw the chair. The server is so busy working that he won't notice a thing. <laughs> the chair is still standing, but it should tip over pretty easily. Let's try to do that again. Time for another go. We got it. There we go. Oh! That would have hurt the being made of flesh and blood. Hey, what's going on? Uh, nothing's working. Has the server crashed? <laughs> you could say so. And I'm standing in a restricted parking zone right now. Oh, I've just about had enough of this. You pay all that money month after month, the developers make huge profits and still nothing works. <laughs> Everything they've got is junk. All a whole load of totally outdated technology. I've had enough. I'm writing a complaint. If they don't get their technical problems under control, then I'm out of here. Absolutely. Me too. Excellent. It looks like all I have to do is ensure a second technical problem, and the two will finally stop playing. Hmm. The first complaint from the players landed right in the waste bin. <laughs> The demon might notice if I were to take his inkwell and exact. Uh. 
He seems to have survived the crash well enough. <laughs> Maybe we can do this I again. I think I've strained the database enough. The first complaint from the players. Mm hmm. Well, there's still not anything else we can do. Excuse me. Hmm. Hmm. And playing pleasure still unimpaired. To be honest, these constant technical problems irritate me. Robbing so and sos. They screw us for one gold piece a week. And that's with six players worldwide. Think about it. That's six gold pieces a week. You think with that kind of dosh they could buy some better technology? Precisely, but it's still fun, nevertheless. <laughs> yes. That's right. Yes. And play to be honest, these cons Robbie. You think precise Yes. There's gonna be something well we then, can do. See you. Hmm. 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 Thanks for nothing. Excuse me. Hmm. Hmm. Well. Hmm. Hmm. We have to do something. He seems to have survived the crash well enough. Hmm. There's nothing we can do. Let's go back outside. See if there's anything else I can possibly do. This machine is somehow I have to disturb his work. The mage teacher and the merchant aren't going to be much use as long as the game is running. Let's head outside and look around. Anything else? Let's head out here, I guess. Oh. Okay then, I'll collect some of those bugs in the jar. Ooh, beetles, bugs, and all sorts of creepy crawlies are scurrying around inside the jar. Wonder what we can do. I don't really know what kind of tree. We got that. Well, wait a second. Was there anywhere else we could go? No. Doesn't like it. So let's head back inside, I guess. Hmm, let's see. Ah! Oh, what's going on now? The server's gone crazy. <laughs> Completely buggy. That's what I thought. Ah! That's it. I can't be bothered anymore. I'm checking this in. They'll suffer the consequences for what they're doing. Right. Well, I'll give them one more chance. Oh. But just one. It's not like we couldn't stop if we wanted to. We could, but we don't want to. Too right. Except if they don't get the grips with their problems. Then it's over. Write that to them. No way. What will it take to finally get those two to stop playing? Hmm. And that makes two complaints in the bin. Those two aren't going to take much more of this. The demon might notice if I would And that And that makes two complaints in the bin. Those two aren't going Hmm. Well Excuse me. Hmm. Hmm? Why are you still playing in the face of all these technical problems? Quite honestly, I'm fed up with it. You just want to play in peace, and time and again the technology screws it up for you. I really can't be bothered with it anymore. 
If there's just one more disaster, that'll be it as far as I'm concerned. Oh, come on. Let's go and see if anything's happening at the driving license issuing office. Hmm. If we have to. Wouldn't you rather just quit playing? Maybe you're right, but I've just got to fill out this form. And then I must get a new cleaning cloth for my glasses. And we need to go and pick up the rent subsidy certificate down at the citizen's residential registration office. Oh, right. But then we can extend the loan period at the library while we're at it. Maybe one of the books is even overdue. <sighs> I fear I have to ensure there's a third technical problem. Hmm. Well then, see you. Hmm. Is there anything else that, uh... Thanks for nothing. Let's check again. I have a th don't know. I don't see anything. The server seems to be bug free again. At least he's back to working as usual. Oh, I wonder if we have to catch that bunny. Maybe it'll uh, do something. We're done with the server's room. Let's look in the drain again. A very dirty drain. The sewer should be down there somewhere. A very... I guess not. Is there anything in here? This must be the last market store. The mo Nothing more is going to be sold here as long as the... Hmm. We gotta get that bunny. Here, rabbit, rabbit, rabbit. Not a chance. I mean, maybe we'll go this way. Is there anything over here? No, 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 no! Not look at the sign. Why is it doing that? Swamp of swamp of death. I don't think. So. I already have enough creepy crawlies. Thank you. Hmm. Well, I guess that's it for this episode. Next time, we'll try to figure out what we can do to stop this game. This is Tachi signing out. Have a good day.